richpaulvancegreatdad.com. And uh, if you've looked at some of the other videos, you know that I have uh, gotten onto the bandwagon with the Insta360 cameras, both the, the Go and the One X2, both of which are action-oriented cameras. And if they do nothing else, they improve your perception of yourself as a very action-oriented surfing, skiing, mountain climbing, jumping in the water type of person. And that's, I think, most of what you're buying with these cameras because they... Um, they they don't get as much use as you want to, but they are as cool as hell. I just uh, had, was at dinner last night with somebody and used 360 camera, and it is really a conversation uh, conversation piece. And even though people joke that it's a really a toy, the 360 degree camera especially really does capture the ambiance of a you know of a, of a setting, whether it's a, like a sunset where you can see everything around you, including the sunset, or a dinner like we had last night where there are four people at a table, impossible to get us all together unless we scrunched together and had the the waiter take a picture. But um, with the 360 camera, you get everybody sitting at the table at once. So one of the key things about the 360 cameras is the invisible selfie stick feature. And this is only uh, possible because of the AI that recognizes the selfie stick. I, I, think, I guess we would recognize any selfie stick, but Insta360 sells a bunch of selfie sticks to go with it. That um, basically makes that you know, long object that you're holding the camera with disappear in the, the videos after when they're in uh, processing within, within the, uh, within the uh, camera itself or within the app that's doing stitching together the the photos or videos. So I, I've become kind of a collector of these things, kind of uh, uh, without really thinking of it because they've had these great sales where they, they'll charge a little, they'll, um, they'll give you, they'll, they have like 20% off on the camera or whatever. And to get the free shipping, you had to you know spend 15, $20 more. And that, that actually is the price of the of the selfie stick. So it's basically, you're getting something for free by spending the extra money, get the free shipping, therefore you don't have to pay for the shipping. Long story short, now I have three selfie sticks from Insta360, but that's not the the, uh, the limit of their range. They actually make a lot more of them. And we can talk about a little bit about that today, but really what I'm gonna focus on today is their selfie stick that comes with a, a tripod already uh, included. So this is the box that it, that it comes in. The Insta360 invisible selfie stick and tripod. And I thought this was, it was fun. Like I say, I paid nothing for it because I would have paid for shipping. So uh, I got this and regular price is uh, $25. And it's kind of a thicker, uh, uh, th th this is basically the only thing in the box <laughs> is the, uh, is the, the uh, selfie stick and a little bit of, a little bit of padding, a little instruction that just tells you not to get your fingers caught when you're using the, the, the tripod. But this, this is basically it. And uh, so it's a little bit thicker than the other tripods that, or the other selfie sticks that they make because it has this tripod feature. And it's just a button that you push at the top and then it opens up a tripod. And then you have the tripod, the full length of this thing without the tripod is about 41 inches or 42 inches, uh, let's see, 42 inches, 41 inches. And then with the tripod, because you can see there's a you know delta between where the top of the where the bottom of the legs are and the the, the bottom of the, the the stick itself, you add another about an inch or, inch or so onto that length. So you, you have a 40, uh, 41, 41 or 42 inch long tripod. And that's a, you know, that's a good long, uh, long distance. And that's only uh, $25. So if you compare this though, with the other ones that they make, this one is, uh, I think, uh, Twenty twenty dollars. This is the smallest one. I think it's twenty seven. Only extends to twenty seven inches. So, you know, uh, enough so that you can get, you know, you can get uh, your camera far enough away from you to get a full shot, but not as long as forty two inches. They also have one that is. This one was is actually cheaper. It's longer, but it's cheaper. Doesn't have a tripod, obviously. And this one extends to um, forty two inches as well now that one's that one's 42 inches as well um and it's about the same it's about the same length as the well i guess it's actually shorter than the the one that's that's shorter so 27 inches 42 inches uh but what you get is uh they weigh about the same even though this one has got 
is longer. I don't know what they're, they're made of something that's, that's really light, but really sturdy. I mean, versus other, other tripods that I have, like here's a, here's a tripod that's, uh, you know, just kind of, it's got, uh, steel, but doesn't feel as, as secure. These are, these are really well, well designed. They're beautiful to look at. And, um, they, they work, like I say, with the stitching capability to disappear magically in your, in your photos. Now, the other one that they make is a, a 10 foot long one, and they just um, uh, in, did an improvement of that. So they, they have one that's 10 feet long at $69 and on a brand new model. That's, I, I believe it's a little shorter and a little bit lighter, but it's $99 for basically the same thing. What I found, if you do like I do and you bought some, got some of these free with uh, the, the lack of shipping is in a fix, you know, if you needed to do a 10 foot long uh, selfie stick, you could use this. I don't think I'd want to use this long term because it's not really meant for that process. But if you're taking, you know, just a few shots and you needed that long a stick, this will extend to, uh, I'd say, a good six to seven feet with the two of them together. Now, the ones that these these two that lack the tripod, they do have the benefit that they can screw into each other and work like that. Uh, and any camera, any camera mount, this is a uh, mount for a, uh, an iPhone or any kind of mobile phone, just goes on the top like that. Uh, that's just, just a screw on mount. It's the same type of screw that uh, screw in mount that you have on any SLR or any other, any other camera. So it's great for that. Um, the, what would be lacking in the one with the tripod. Now the tripod has obviously the ability to, to have the tripod bottom, which they do sell separately. They will sell you a, a separate tripod bottom. So you'd only get this part um, for $15 or something. But what this would lack then would be the ability to screw something onto this side. Though I guess I have the power now to take all three of them and string them together in like a massive, uh, uh, selfie stick, which might uh, bend a little bit because it's got all these just different points of, of flex. So that's really it. They, they all work basically the same. There's no real magic to it. I guess for my money, uh, when, I'm when I'm traveling, I like to use the small one because it will actually, it'll actually almost fit in your pocket and it's fairly light. This one is just a little bit longer, but you can see how it really stick out of your pocket, especially if it's attached to you know, your, your camera, you got, you got it attached to your camera and now you're sticking in your pocket. You've got something quite large. So that's it. Again, uh, this little guy, they're all about the same price, you know, between 16 and $25. They are a good accessory. If you are doing any kind of uh, shooting with your camera, they work with a, you know, any kind of other mount that could work with your, SLR, if you needed to, if you had a, some sort of remote control, probably. Uh, well, not even, I mean, it depends on how far away the camera is. If it's, you know, 10 feet away from you, I guess you need, you need, a, need a remote control. Usually I'm pushing the button, you know, right from it. So, uh, and using any one of these cameras, you can set off, set it, set it to uh, take the camera, the, take the shot in, you know, three seconds, enough time for you to push the button and then put it in position. All right, Paul Banks with GreatDad.com. Again, that's the Insta360 invisible selfie stick in all its permutations. See you next time. Bye.